They're getting ready for day two here at the queue in downtown Cleveland, but still plenty of time to dissect all of the sound bites from day one. And that Melania Trump speech that you just played a clip from is getting all of the attention this morning because of accusations that it sounded strikingly similar to the speech that Michelle Obama gave back at the Democratic National Convention in 2008. Let me play for you the two chunks. First, Michelle Obama in 2008, then Melania Trump in 2016. And you can decide for yourself if this is the same speech or just similar thoughts and ideas all mashed up together. Here's Michelle Obama in 2008. Barack and I were raised with so many of the same values. Like, you work hard for what you want in life. That your word is your bond, that you do what you say you're gonna do. That you treat people with dignity and respect. From a young age, my parents impressed on me the values that you work hard for what you want in life. That your word is your bond and you do what you say and keep your promise. That you treat people with respect. So Paul Manafort, the Trump campaign aide, is out on television this morning. He says there is no cribbing of the Michelle Obama speech. In fact, these are just common ideas that are out there in the world. And, and people who are making speeches, particularly first lady hopefuls, will kind of use all of these same ideas. So that's the argument. That controversy is, is going to dominate the morning here as people sort of dissect that and figure out what to make of it, whether it really matters at all uh, what a future first lady has to say. But take a look at the day two lineup of speakers here. We've got a chart showing you some of the political figures we're going to see on a day where the theme is the economy uh, across the nation. Paul Ryan, the Speaker of the House, that should be a dramatic moment uh, because he's a guy who was reluctant to endorse but finally did endorse Donald Trump. Then Mitch McConnell, Chris Christie, who lost out in the vice presidential sweepstakes last week to Mike Pence, and Ben Carson as the political highlights of the day today. And then also we're going to see some more of the Trump family up there speaking on the stage. Donald Trump Jr. will be speaking, and Tiffany Trump will be speaking as well. And guys, I can guarantee you that campaign aides have to be going through those Trump family speeches today, Googling line by line, just to make sure there are no other similarities to other Obama family speeches over the years, guys. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you're going to find videos packed with all of the information that you need to be smarter about your finances. You can subscribe by clicking right here and click on all the videos around me or the I right here to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.